Hey guys, so I wanted a new planter but didn't want to spend money on it. So instead I opted for a DIY for which I got the old dabba that I already had and I'm going to paint it. I'm going for a cow print and I'll put up a reference picture here so you have an idea. I'm going to do two coats of white acrylic paint between each coat. I have kept like a 10 minutes of drying time. Then I'm going to draw the desired design with a pencil to have a rough idea. Uh, to be honest, I ended up not following the pencil marks as a reference because it was too time consuming to follow the tiny design detail. So I went freehand and started making shapes that looked like cow prints. Once uh, dried up, I erased the pencil marks. Also make sure that you make holes underneath the pot before transferring the plant in the pot. I used a hot fork to make holes as it was plastic and it was super easy to do it with hot fork and moving on to the next DIY it's basically a painting on printers that I saw and I wanted to try so I took a cardboard that I got off a parcel from Amazon and I chopped it into half and wrapped it around the black chart paper that I already had and taped it behind to the board and used the paint that I already uh, like I made by mixing different colors like red, yellow, black, white. So these are the four colors that I mixed and made these shades out of it. And then I tried following the video on Pinterest. As I didn't have a paint of the same like thick consistency, I just randomly poured the paint. And by using a 30 centimeter scale, I dragged the whole thing down just like in the video. I uh, should have used the smaller scale like the 15 centimeters wale hote hai I changed the whole plan and went all over again and again for quite a few times. Also added the dark shade of brown and repeated the same thing. Not exactly like the video or the inspiration that I took but again it was an inspiration and whatever I did was unique to itself. So hopefully you like this painting. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and this is how the pot and the painting looks together. So do let me know how did you like it and all the other DIYs that you would like me to try and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!